Hey, what's up guys, I'm Beef Brody. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to recover the accidentally deleted Facebook campaign. I did it to myself this morning, and as I was going through the steps, I thought this might be helpful information for you guys to know. This is one of those mistakes that you're bound to make, uh, and I've done it two, maybe three times now, uh, and partially because of the Facebook interface, like you, you have a campaign selected or an ad set selected, and then you select another one, not realizing the first one is selected. And maybe you delete one because you know uh, it was a mistake or, or whatever the case is, you hit delete, and then it deletes the other one that was selected that you didn't know was selected. But don't stress out, uh, we can kind of sort of recover it. I'll take you through the steps to do so. So let's jump onto the computer. So let's, uh, let's assume this interview I did when I was, had Gary V on our podcast, let's delete, no, let's not delete that one. Yeah, we can delete that one, screw it, why not? We'll recover it. So we're gonna delete that one. Let's say it was an accident. We thought we were deleting the one we wanted. Boom, that one's gone. This is where you freaked out, right? You're like, oh dang, I just deleted this ad. I didn't wanna delete that, I needed that. It was live, it was whatever the case is. Here's what you're gonna do. You are gonna go into the search up here in the top left. And by the way, this back end of Ads Manager is changing all the time. This is as of November 2020. So it should still be similar. There might be a few variations depending on when you watch this video. Anyways, if you filter this through, you go to delivery here. You're gonna go to uh, campaign delivery and you're gonna filter deleted and hit apply. And then you're gonna, what I would suggest you do is that you go to, um, you can really type in to deleted and you can say, you don't want the name to say deleted. You wanna filter by delivery is deleted. So ad set deleted and then you can do ad delivery is deleted as well. So then when you come through here and this is the one that we deleted and you click it, it's gonna show you the ad sets that were deleted as well as the ad that was deleted. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is go through here and start duplicating some of these. So this particular one is checked. We're gonna hit duplicate. You wanna duplicate the original. What that's gonna do is only duplicate the campaign itself. It's not gonna duplicate the ad sets or the ads within it. So you're gonna rename this, whatever, we'll just leave it on the default copy. I'll hit publish. So once the campaign is published, you'll go back in here, you'll click on the deleted campaign so that you can get into the ad sets. You'll click on the ad set that you want to duplicate. In this case, we'll click on this one. We'll hit duplicate here. We're gonna to go to existing campaign. You wanna duplicate this into the one that you into the campaign that you just generated the one that's named whatever it was copy you'll hit duplicate it's going to put that ad set back into that campaign you can hit publish and then you'll click into that it'll get to the ad level you'll have to go through this now check that box hit duplicate existing campaign, but then come down to the existing ad set. This is where it's gonna be, again, the copy of the, the one that you made. You hit duplicate, verify whatever information you need to verify in here, hit publish. And then once you go back in, you clear these filters out, you'll be able to see under your campaigns, uh, this is the one that we duplicated right here. You'll want to make sure you turn on all of this stuff. So you go to the campaign level, turn the campaign on. You'll go to ad sets. Make sure you turn that on at the ad set level. And then go to the ads level and turn on the ads. If you have multiple ad sets and multiple ads inside this, you'll be, have to go through the same process. You can bulk select it. So if you have you know, multiple ad sets within one campaign, just highlight all of them and hit duplicate, and then go into each one of your ad sets, highlight all of the ads, hit duplicate, and then duplicating it into those duplicate campaigns and ad sets you've, it, that you've created up there. Guys, I hope that makes sense to you. It's a quick, simple hack. It's not as scary as you might think. 
uh, if you check the box it should duplicate all of your engagement and all that type of stuff. You will likely lose a lot of your learning data and things like that, but at least the ad, a lot of the work isn't lost, right? And you won't have to go through and set up everything from scratch again. You can just kind of duplicate that stuff. This is the best way that I am aware of uh, currently around this problem to fix this oops, you know, if you will. So if you have a better solution to it, please let us know in the comments below. If this is your first time seeing one of my videos, I would love for you to subscribe, stick around for other e-commerce and brand building content, marketing, etc. Like this video. If you liked it, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.